place. I'm sure it's not what you wanted. How, how are you feeling right now? Um, as far as I was disappointed, but I mean, compared to last year, I'm just glad I was able to have a healthy race. And I came in fourth as opposed to fifth or worse. So that's how I look at it. I mean, did you execute the way you wanted? Was there anything that you feel like you made any mistakes? No. I ran the way I wanted. And that's why I'm not as upset because I did what I needed to do. Coming around that final time, what do you think? I'm thinking you were still going to make the team up. Do you feel yourself selected? Uh, I felt hope always um, that I would make the team. But everything happens for a reason. I'm not upset. Um, I had a long season, and I'm really happy to end it on this snow. I mean, do you still feel as strong as you want, or did that long season, do you feel like that contributes at all to just like maybe you feel more tired this week and you've been racing since what, January or so? Well, I mean, that's the thing about all the college kids out here is that we've had a really long season. And so, I'm not going to say that that is an excuse for me not doing good. It's just that today, you know, it was just what it was. So I'm kind of taking it for what it is. But I'm still appreciative of the opportunity. Do you plan to continue racing this summer? Or yeah, I think so. I think my coach talked about it. But now that this um, meet is over, we'll have to talk about a lot more things. Yeah, like trying to sort of things. Or where I'll be running overseas or anything. Yeah. Yeah. I want to get stronger um, endurance wise. And that's something that each of them have. They're really good um, endurance wise. So I know that that's something that I need to work on. I mean, how much are you running? Do you run like mileage in between walkouts? Or is it you want to track every day? What is your, how's your training right now? I mean, right now, it's kind of drifting off of NTs. So, of course, I can't go as hard as I wanted to because I have to be able to recover and still do well at this meet after NCs. But, I mean, there's still some mileage that I know I need to work on. Are you surprised how quickly, I mean, Ajay ran 157 uh -huh. off the counter at like 59.6 or something. Yeah. Are you surprised how that you, you were like close to even splits and got you know, dropped at the end? Are you surprised how quickly? Um, no. I don't get surprised by anything in the 800. I mean, it's really two laps of anything could happen. So, that's kind of how I see it, but um, that's definitely, I mean, I didn't even realize we were going that fast, more so because I had to focus on me. But um, it's pretty amazing how she can go out there and really do some damage and run those fast times. Definitely someone I look up to. How yeah. Do you, how do you pick teal? What goes into that? Well, it's actually green. Then I did an overlay, and as I trained, as I was warming up, it kind of faded to like teal. I was like, oh, my nails are teal too. <laughs> but yeah, kind of with my my motto, you know, look good, run good. So yeah. <laughs> Will that change 